Hello guys, I'm Aniki Wafi and welcome back to my channel. So I got a request few days ago about how to overclock a Ryzen 3 3200G without a GPU. So let me show you my PC, my spec. So here we got AMD Ryzen 3 3200G with Vega graphics and my GPU down here is AMD Radeon Vega 8 graphics. So this is an integrated GPU built in Ryzen 3 itself. So the, the recommended software is AMD Ryzen Master. AMD Ryzen Master. You can download it for free at the AMD's website. Let me show you how to overclock it. <laughs> so <coughs> let's use profile 2. First click manual and then drag everything to 4000 so actually the ryzen 3 3200g uh <coughs> normal boost is the 3.6 gigahertz or 3600 megahertz so we're going to overclock it we're going to test it with 4 gigahertz first after turning up the core or clock at or clock core speed turn up the voltage up to going to try 1.1.35 5 okay after that we're going to overclock the gpu and we're going to overclock it up to 1700 voltage we're going to try 1.2 okay click apply then going to minimize this one we're going to stress test the cpu using either 64 i'm going to use the trial version well this so we need to stress test it about 20 to 30 minutes let's click start so if it's crash it's not safe so we have to turn down some clock for the cpu since we are testing the cpu right now after doing a few tests so 4, 4 gigahertz is the safest one with the highest 1.35 volt when i tried 4.2 gigahertz it's cr it's crashing i even tried the voltage until 1.4 volt and it's crash so remember this is a stock cooler not <clears throat> i'm not using any different cooler this is a stock cooler comes with the processor itself so after testing the, the cpu now we have to ta test the gpu we're going to use 720p presets And again, we we're, we have to stress test it for about 20 to 30 minutes. So after doing some tests, uh, I even turn up the GFX volt <coughs> GPU core up to 1800 megahertz or 1.8 gigahertz and turn up the voltage up to 1.35 voltage and it's crash so it's not safe so we're going to stick with the 4 gigahertz with 1.35 volt and 1.7 gigahertz with 1.2 volt so let me show you a benchmark that I did before and during this overclocking.
I only be able to benchmark GTA 5 and run a 3D Mark test. I think overclocking this APU is not worth in my opinion, but our opinion and games that we play is different. So I think the benefit and FPS gain from overclocking is gonna be different for different game as well. Let me know what you thought about it in the comment section below. I guess that's it for me. Thank you very much for watching and your request as well. Thank you very much. See you guys in the next video and stay awesome.